Hi, my name is Pauline Young. I'm a licensed financial planner and I'm also a certified chartist. Many people ask me, what is the difference between Hekin Ashi and also the candlestick? And in this video, I'm going to explain the difference between Hekin Ashi and the candlestick. I want to talk about there is one chart pattern, I mean a candlestick that is very similar to candlestick. And then if you to click this, you can see that it's called Hekin Ashi. Okay, now you recognize this. See if I can do side by side. So I'm trying to see side by side. Okay, so this one is candlestick, and then this one I put Hikin Ashi. Okay, mm. what is the difference that you can see? The shape is the same, right? The shape is the same, but what what happened to the candlestick? Yeah, okay, what what happened? Yeah. What happened here when you see this one all up? Maybe I erase it. Shadow. Do you notice that this one has more shadow, the long shadow? Okay, the tail. Whereas this one has less shadow. Okay, so that is one. Another more obvious one. How about you see? Uh, this one going up. Okay, we just observe this uptrend here. This one when it goes up. You notice that it is green, 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 red, 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 green, red, green, red. Cannot see the red in the uptrend. Correct. You see all green here, and then all red here. Green, red, green here. So, but here you see some red here. Okay, so why? This is the the biggest difference for um a king. Hakin Ashi and also the candlestick. The biggest difference is the calculation of the Hakin Ashin. The calculation of the Hakin Ashin is that the opening price for each of the opening price the next day, uh, they are using the previous day's average. Okay, the word Hakin in Japanese means average. So you are looking at the opening price for today is looking at the average price of yesterday. So you, you see what I mean? So that means they are looking at today. I don't care what is your real opening. I'm using yesterday's open and closing average and then put it today's opening. However, for candlestick, what is today's open will be today's open they will not refer anything to do with yesterday's price candlestick chart pattern opening is today's opening however the hekin ashi is referring the opening referring to yesterday's average of the opening and the closing it takes the yesterday's price what happened if there is a bad news for the stock that you are trading Okay, if there's a bad news of the stock that you are trading, when there is an opening, what happened? Slower reaction to bad news. Yeah. So basically for Akin Hashi, right? Uh, you, the opening price is already using the average already. So basically the feeling of the using the average, right? It is not so much on uh, short-term day-to-day trading. It's more on a longer-term kind of a trend, look at the trend, you see the average, and then you see the trend. If you were to use the um, candlestick, you will uh, have to recognize today's price action alone. You don't take yesterday's price into consideration, meaning that today, if there is uh, suddenly a bad news, then you'll be, you'll be looking at a gap down. If let's say today there's a good news, then you'll see a gap up. And gap up and gap down, right, is the most popular trading strategies for traders. When you see a gap up, the sign is clear, the, the trade is up trend, and then you just pop into the, the trend and then you can ride onto the trend. Okay, so the, the, the chances of success is quite high whenever you trade the gaps. If you can um, use the candlestick chart pattern, it is more meaningful because you will take on the today's opening because each day of the opening, it is so important. Today opening, if it's at this level, then it will go all the way up. 
if today's opening is this level, then it will be a bearish. So the opening itself, right, for any traders, it is so important because it will give you a signal of what is the trend for today. So I will I will say that okay, if I want to um go for a long term or more on uh, looking at the trend to see a, a more clear clear trend, uh, this Heikin Ashi definitely give me a very clear trend. Oh, uptrend, very clear. Downtrend, uptrend. Okay, so it's very very clear. This one is like it's mixed. Okay, it's mixed, and then a lot of. Uh, we shadows and then a lot of gaps so it will not give me a, a good clear trend but however this one is good for big picture this one is good for small micro because if you do zoom in then you see all the gaps wow this is a gap up good go in go all the way up so here can you see the gap okay, zoom in you can see the gap. Okay, you um here. Okay, here. Okay, you can see the gap because it will ignore the opening for today. It will ignore completely. It doesn't care what is today's opening. It just care for what is yesterday's opening and closing. So that is the difference. Okay. Yeah.